Yeah, I mean, first of all, it was a good atmosphere. You know, I think, you know, when you're over break, you don't have students. Um, the, team, the job that our marketing um, department has been doing and getting people in the stands, and it's been exciting for us to play in front of. I thought our guys came out, and I thought Mercer sort of threw the first punch and hit us, and we were a little bit more worried about offensive end than, than, than what we want to be is focusing on the defensive end and getting some stops. I thought it was a turn there when we got a couple steals. Russell had a, had a couple steals, and the momentum started to pick up, and the energy started to pick up, and, and, and guys started to make some plays. Mentioned Russell and then that you know, basically four points to win with the steal. Yes, he brought a 23 points. You talked about his defense today, how important that defense was in this game. Yeah, I mean, he does a really, really good job at the point of attack. I tell him, you know, if I'm on defense and I see a guy up there working as hard as he does, it makes me want to work hard and make sure I don't want to let down the defense. So he sort of sets the tone in that and then just, you know, pressuring the guys. It's, you know, if I'm playing, I want to play with my face you know, facing the offense. And he, he does a good job of making the guys turn his back. So just that first pass is difficult. Um, and then everybody else follows suit. And I thought we did a really, really good job. And Mercer's awesome on the glass. You know, that's what they do. They're big, they're physical. For us to be plus 16 on the glass was a, was a, was a huge key in the game for us. So I thought our guards came down and helped up and cleaned up rebound. I thought our bigs did a good job battling on the glass. I mean, it's hard, man. They got some big bodies out there as well. Yeah, I mean, he does a really, really good job at the point of attack. I tell him, you know, if I'm on defense and I see a guy up there working as hard as he does, it makes me want to work hard and make sure I don't want to let down the defense. So he sort of sets the tone in that and then just, you know, pressuring the guys. It's, you know, if I'm playing, I want to play with my face, you know, facing the offense. And he, he does a good job of making the guys turn his back. So just that first pass is difficult. Um, and then everybody else follows suit. And I thought we did a really, really good job. And Mercer's awesome on the glass. You know, that's what they do. They're big, they're physical. For us to be plus 16 on the glass was a, was, a, was a huge key in the game for us. So I thought our guards came down and helped up and cleaned up rebound. I thought our bigs did a good job battling on the glass. I mean, it's hard, man. They got some big bodies out there as well. Yeah, I mean, we talk about, you know, being playing with relentless effort. We talk about competing with excellence, and we talk about the power of the unit. We, we try to make sure those three things show up. Um, but some, some, a couple other words we've been talking about lately was trust and discipline, like trust in the game plan and then being disciplined to that game plan. And I think, you know, over the last couple of games, our guys have started to grow in that area and playing with more consistency in that area. And, uh, and that just, you know, it just benefits us. So for us, I mean, I tell, I tell our own guys, like we're 42% team shooting. I mean, that's just who we are sometimes, you know, and we know that we got to be able to guard people. You know, we, we, we want to play the game in the 50s and the 60s. If we get out and we make some shots, kudos. But more importantly, we got to get out and sit down and defend every single night.